<laughs> Speaking of a little tart. Hey. hey. Shall we get baking? Let's bake. Let's bake. All right. We're going to actually use the oven today. Ooh. Last week we got cut a little short. I was finished within like a half an hour. So today I'm going to make it all in front of you. So we are going to make our base, which is pretty simple. We have a half a cup of unsalted butter and uh, all of the ingredients and the method will be below the video in the description. And um, so you can do it yourself at home. Oh, I'm going ahead here. All right. So, hey, Melody, Richard's Hi. here. Richard Bruin says, hello, sweet. So happy to be here this Hi, Friday. Hi, Richard. Thank you for joining we us. Are so happy you are here with us this Friday, Richard. We are making a chocolate amaretto butterscotch tart. And Very Robert P said, howdy, y'all. Hey, hi, Robert P. All right, so we are going to whip this up in a, thank you, uh, in a blender with the paddle attachment. I'm not going to use the big guns today, so put it back there. And she is going to whip up the butter, let some air get in there, and then we will add the sugar in. And while she's doing that, I'm going to prep the filling a little bit, just so we can keep it moving. So you want to add a half a cup of, again, unsalted butter. We'll add the salt later. It's just a better way to keep the control of the ingredients that you're adding in. Mmm. Why does butter make everything just taste so delicious? Hey, Robert T. Um, mentions Richard is always here. I think he's here before you all. And, <laughs> and that's the way we yeah, like it. Yeah. Thank Ready you. Ready and waiting. Yeah. I think whoever said that just must be jealous. <laughs> jealous, I say. All right, I'm going to move this over. Oh, oh Richard, oh, this. It's got a beef here. All I right. Really said, yeah, I think I missed a couple of screens. <laughs> or maybe you just missed the ones we didn't do. We weren't here. <laughs> exactly. so. All right. So we are going to get this butter melting. So we'll just put that on a medium heat. And we will add our ingredients straight to that. Everything up here. Uh oh, Pearl wants to go outside. Oh, I gotta introduce you guys to my baby soon. Although I think I've already introduced it to everyone watching. Two thirds a cup heavy whipping cream. Let's go in here. I can't wait. I wish that. What was it? It's not smell a vision, taste a vision. Mm. Oh, scratch and sniff. Scratch and sniff. <laughs> but I really want them to taste this. Oh, Richard is saying, uh, by the way, we're looking and sounding great today. Thanks. Aw, thank you, Richard. Thanks for the feedback. Andrea Anderson said, happy Friday, everyone. Hi, happy Friday. Thank you for being here. Uh, we are making a chocolate amaretto butterscotch tart. And we love your questions and comments, oh, oh. so keep them coming. <laughs> Everybody, Miss Tickle is here channeling your most innermost desires and your questions to me, so please bring them on. Thank you, Miss Tickle. You're welcome. So fabulous, Miss Tickle. I'm always here as well. Me and Richard. <laughs> Tickle is a phenomenal burlesque performer, costume designer extraordinaire, and co-creator of Sweet Spot, which she's one of my favorite creative brains. I always tell her I want to lick her brain because I'm sure that I would get some kind of something from that. Mm -hmm. I think. Okay. All right. So Melody, you want to add sugar to this? Yeah, you can go ahead. I can show that. Thank you, Buttercup. I wish I had Buttercup in my kitchen all the time. It would just make things so much easier. And she's lovely to look at. Aww. Everybody <laughs> needs a little Buttercup in their lives. Everybody needs a lot of Buttercup. All right, so. 
So in the filling that you want to get going is the butter, the light brown sugar, heavy whipping cream, and you want to just let that bubble. And it does take, it takes like 15 minutes. You want to really get it, I'll show it to you when it happens. It'll start bubbling and foaming up. And then you want to remove it, whisk it, and then it'll create a thicker, a thicker cream consistency. Oh, it's almost like a caramel, except because we are adding everything at first, we won't have any issues with the caramel seasoning on live TV. Hey there. All right, let's see. We've got that going. We have that going. And, oh, we're doing okay on time, actually. Yeah. 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 How's everybody You're doing so out there? Melody. I'm trying. I'm getting a little better here every week. You're doing great. Thanks. All right, so once it starts bubbling around the edges, you just want to turn it down and keep stirring. The butter is still not melted all the way, but you just let it melt on down. Mm. Oh, hey, okay. how was your show that you that we were talking about last week? Uh, oh, it went so good. The museum show went really well. Um, Everyone did a wonderful job. And then I ran afterwards to go do a quick spot with a musician in town that I know, Sean DeGraff. And um, shout out to Sean. Sean, love you, Sean. And yeah, just ran in there, did a quick spot, closed out the set because it was the end of the night. It was the quickest gig I've ever done. I was like in and out in 20 hey. minutes. <laughs> That's nice though. I love it. Love that. Quick gig for now. I don't have my trash bowl today. All right, I can probably start adding these other ingredients. All right. Huh? So after the butter and the sugar, you want to add a teaspoon of vanilla. And I'm going to use this uh, Mexican bean paste that the lovely Penny Tibbet, thanks, baby, had brought from. Mexico. Yum. And it's kind of a theme today. So whip that up like that. If you make the noises, it tastes better. Was sure. that salt? That was salt and, and almond flour. Almond flour. Sweet. And that's it. Mix that up. And you want to get it so that it kind of ends up looking like sand. Sand. Perfect. A sandy texture. And midway through, you'll have to scrape it down. Little too. Scrape it down. Scrape it down. I forgot what I was doing. Hey. All right. So while that is going, this is bubbly. I I think I might just bring out our, our first guest a little early because we're just flying through this. But is is our, is does he look like he's Oh, oh, yeah. Oh, good. Oh, I'm ready. Oh, actually, how do you even... Oh, the other one, because he's in the yeah, no. fridge. Oh, Sorry. i got to check. Hold on. Let me just yeah, make sure just he's, say it, it, we, he's ready. One second. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, good. Okay, just wait one minute. Let me stir this. Because he's going to come out. I'm going to get all swoony and discombobulated. He is a fierce, fierce performer. Mesmerizing on stage. He is here with the Dita Von Tees show on the strip, stripping on the strip. Let's hear a loud round of applause for the stunning Jet Adore. Will you, will you just grab the cream? Oh, sure. Yeah. Okay, great. Thank you. Oh, oh, oh it's Jet, delightful. Yes. It was so yeah. <laughs> I finished up the last of the vegan meatloaf. I hope you don't mind. Oh, that was. With a few little dilled gherkins. Oh, that's delicious. good. It's been in there for a while, though, because I might have liked the cream, too. Oh, that's going to make I it taste better. I do tend better. to like cream if it's around. Oh, okay. Wow. <laughs> yeah, I'm getting a little bit there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, All right. Is this the butterscotch yeah. Oh, God, yes. <laughs> I love a bubbly I told you. I told you I would get all swoony. And I don't know how you knew that butterscotch is my favorite flavor. I People know. People make fun of me because they say that it makes me old man. Does it? Why? Oh, because butterscotch is a classic kind of. 
I don't know if you can see it. It's hard to show because you can't really move. But it was bubbling, and you could see the air. It's it's so got a little cool. broth on the top. Little broth, just it's like you, so good. Thank you for that extra vocab. Appreciate it. All right, so we're gonna put that all the way down, and just kind of let that bubble and thicken up a little. In the meantime, I'm gonna make some whipped cream. Oh, Penny! Penny's with us. Oh, Penny Tibbet. She said, "Everybody looks so yummy." Aww. Oh. Penny, 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 Penny pours is going to be very strange today because I'm just going to chuck it all in there and and hope that it tastes good. I guess it's not that much different than what you were doing. <laughs> just joking. All right. So the trick with whipped cream. That looks great. That's good. Yeah. Okay. Let's get that in actually. It's going in the pie tin. This goes in the pie tin and we will want to just smash it. Pressed. Mm hmm. Smashing. Smash. Would you like to do the honors? Sure. Oh, That's a like lot. It? it is. It looks like a lot, but it smashes. You smash it and you get it really good up in there. Don't worry, I've washed my hands. And and you just kind of get it. Great. Thanks. Some good smash. Thank you. I am a good smasher. These are tarts. The smash is tart. Oh, I love smashing tarts. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Wow. It sounds violent, right? Yeah, I think smash. I saw that. Oh, yeah, film. that's a little <laughs> smash. Me or, or that punk rock band, The Smashing Tarts, I think. That's funny. That's your next. That's a good title. That's your next punk rock band name. Yeah. I, I was going first for maybe like bitter sweets. You can mix. You know, that can be the name of the first album. <laughs> oh, yeah. You know, and all, all my titles. songs are like, I'm just bitter about everything. <laughs> but, I'm, but my name is Sweets. So, yeah. right? All right, so smashing, smashing. You want to kind of try and get it into the corner so that you don't have super thick corners when you eat into it. Mm. Ooh, I was going to have you smash it. I do that a lot, don't I? Oh, yeah. wait a minute. I Richard mean, I... just said I thought the smashing tarts was buttercup speciality. Ooh, oh, that he is. caught us. You were so right. <laughs> Except I don't That's think that we can do that on totally live TV because she smashes it with an inappropriate piece of Oh, very appropriate. Very appropriate. Yeah. Appropriate. You're right. It might affect the, the G rating. <laughs> we, I could do it in like, um, yeah. like leggings. <laughs> I could do it in yoga pants. It just I mean, won't be as effective. Oh, well, that would be kind of gross, actually. <laughs> <laughs> I'd rather see it on your bum than on yoga pants. Is that, yeah. is that weird? That's my own personal preference, though. Okay, so we're making uh, this like this, because that's the way you describe things when you are trying to teach people something. All right, so will that's you beautiful. hand me a fork, please? Buttercup, buttercup. Buttercup knows where everything is. Buttercup, buttercup. I'm just holding this prop so it looks like I'm but, helping. Yeah, you are helping, actually. <laughs> Although you're making me a little swoony. Yeah. I'm very excited you're here. All right, so now we stab it, but don't oh, wow. stab like I usually do. I get pretty mean. With it. But this way it'll help it not lift up in the oven when it's cooking because you want to keep it as mm -hmm. flat as possible. Is that going all the way through to the pan base? No, no. not. You just kind of, I guess it's about halfway. Mm -hmm. You kind of feel it when you're doing it. You feel the resistance. All right. And then we are going to stick this in the freezer for 10 minutes while we. Aw, thank you. While we heat up. Thank you, sir. I helped. You're very great. <laughs> So we are going to get the oven going. We want the oven on 375. Oh my God. <laughs> okay. And if uh, someone could set a timer for 10 minutes. Okay. Tickle timer. Tickle, tickle timer. Tickle timer. So we're going like this. Oh, it's bubbling. Up. Oh, that's disgusting. Excuse me. 10 Ooh. minutes, you said, right? Yeah. Oh, okay. Uh, Blue, come here, baby. You want to say hi? You sit for me? You sit. I can't touch you, though. You sit? What a good boy! You say hi to everybody? He's like, where's my food? Huh? Everybody, this is Blue. 
Blue just won, is now officially a champion, AKC champion. I'm totally doing this. You ready? Yeah, show it off. Might as well. Look at my baby. He's embarrassed. He is, and he's like, oh, Mom. Isn't he cute? Okay, oh. oh, right, enough of that. Uh oh, this show's gone downhill. I'm talking about my dog. Okay. So this is bubbling. We're gonna whip up some whipped cream. And then our friend Jet said that he's good with decorating. I did not say good. I think I just said I liked it. <laughs> I enjoyed You're like, I'm not good at it. Okay, good. I mean compared to you tonight. Well, we're just gonna we're gonna make the cream, we'll put it in the little jammy jam. And then we'll add it to our cocktail. And as soon as we get the cream ready to go, I'm gonna bring in our next guest, and he can serenade us while I, while I shake up some alcohol. Before you do, Angie just got the auntie says, "See you next week, my family nephew." Oh, hi, Angie. Up for another um, prize. What are you going for next week? Uh, next week she's just visiting. Oh, okay. Blue has, if you're in Vegas, I <laughs> think I'm promoting my dog. Wow. My dogs. And, uh, and my dogs are performing more than I am right now. Uh, you can see Blue at the AKC Dog Show in Las Vegas at the end of March. <laughs> if you want to come and be a cheerleader? I'll be there. I'm actually presenting the awards, <laughs> so he better wow. win. Oh wow, that seems so nice. Mm. Yeah. I know that's what I said. I was like, aren't they gonna think <laughs> that it's set up if he wins? Because yeah. he better win. Yeah. I'm not giving an award to him. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, right, oh, Angie? No. <laughs> if Blue doesn't win at the show that I'm giving the awards to, no one gets an award. That's how I roll. <laughs> All right, we're gonna speed this up because I really want to bring our next guest out. How is that? A bit too much? All right, we're gonna add a little bit of sugar. So again, this is as you can see, it is homemade whipped cream. And we're going along with this Italian Mexican theme today, even in the cocktail. Uh, mm -hmm. That and our powdered sugar. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You know I like it. Stiff. Good stiff. Mm -hmm. Thanks for pointing that out. I appreciate it. It's so dramatic. It is. You want to hear a funny story? Yeah. I won't say his name. I don't want to put anybody on the spot. But there was a holiday party that I went to one time. And this guy came late. And he was like, but I really wanted to make homemade whipped cream for dessert. And he has this, what is it, like a half a pint of heavy whipping cream in, you know, the store-bought container. And he's just shaking. He's shaking it. He's shaking all the time. And I just kind of let him go for it because he had, he, he was with intent. Needless to say, it never whipped up. No. And we all left before he did. <laughs> he's still somewhere. He's still Shake somewhere. That. Shaking that cream. It works for the cream. Uh, can you show us that again? For the right. All right, let's see, it's getting there.
Yeah, baby. I am going to put it in here. Or do you know how to? I don't know. Should I? Okay. Oh, I'm just filling the bag. We're just. Well, sure. But this is a really clever trick. I haven't seen this in oh, Thank you. I have. This is. I usually use a uh, blender because it's got a wider mouth, and I use the bigger bag. Oh boy. It is getting heating up in this we'll kitchen. We'll censor that out. Whipped cream, you see that? Can you open up wide? Ooh. All right, if you want to put that in yeah, there. Just, okay, yeah. And then, of course, I need to give this to Buttercup because Thank she... Oh, Baba, you're in a great spot. Just stepped on my dog's nose. Do you want all of this dog's behind you. Right, so this is now this is so bubbling. Cool. How long is it left on the okay, timer? Still got four minutes, 10 seconds. Ooh, all right. All right, let's see. This is bubbling, and I'm going to just get our gelatin Orlando blooming, and then we're going to bring in our next guest because oh, it's not yeah. cut at the end yet. Oh, i got to cut it at the end. I hit a snag. Hey. <laughs> All right. So let's go like this. Let me just hold on to that. Oh, this is a joke. Oh, actually, if you want to put a pair of scissors in the drawer, let me go. Let me grab you. Some. If you want to tie that off with a rubber band over there, and then we can cut it. So, oh, before we cut, okay. here we go. I'm gonna add a little. Yeah, the water has to be cold for leaf gelatin. I just kind of want to put it in in layers so that they don't kind of get stuck to each other. This is only four grams of gelatin leaves. Gelatin leaves weigh about two grams each. Oh, Bubba's. Is he snoring? He's, mm. he's making noises. <laughs> it's not me snoring, just in case. I don't know. His eyes are open, but yeah, he like is snoring. <laughs> Woo, thank you. All right, we're going to put this to the side because while I am shaking, I would like our next guest Come in, say hi, play us a little ditty. A little ditty. Do you hear him? <laughs> is it in the room? I think he's out. <laughs> what? The dog is out cold. Yeah, he's sleeping. He's just snoring. Oh my God, he's snoring <laughs> right in, the in the middle, middle of, of the kitchen. Can you see him? Kitchen floor. Oh, two Why minutes. Not? I might take All right, ready? Too. We're going to bring in our next guest while I make us some cocktails. He is a phenomenal singer, musician. I had the honor of performing with him a few years back before the end of the world in 2020. And i um, really glad to see him here and have him in our show. Ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together for the wonderful Eddie Clendon. Yay! What's up, everybody? How you doing? Hi, Eddie. Hello. How you doing, baby? Hey, Blue. You're looking pretty dapper there. Well, this is uh, relatively early in the morning for me, I'll be honest. It's but I'll really do anything for, for free us. dessert. So, <laughs> oh, that's good. <laughs> and I heard there might be drinks here, too. And there are going to be some drinks. It Actually, much more than that. I'm going to, if it's okay with you, while you're performing, if it seems right, I might be shaking along to the beat. Oh, okay. If you uh, give us a little. Well, I thought I might pick a little corn for the kids. Uh, you know, a lot of folks, you know, they think I sing only Elvis and that kind of stuff. But I can be offensive too. Great. Oh, yeah. We prove it. We are. Shall we? <laughs> Just because you're pretty and you think you're mighty wise You tell me you love me, then you roll your big blue eyes Now, don't ask me to dress you up in satins and in silk Cause your eyes are like the cherries in a glass of buttermilk I don't roll your bloodshot eyes at me Oh, I can tell you've been out on a spree it's plain that you were lying when you tell me you've been crying Don't roll those bloodshot eyes at me Well, I guess it's a little romance, it's fine, let's simmer down. You ought to go and join the circus gal, cause you look just like a clown. Your eyes are like a road map, and I'm scared to smell your breath. So you better close them peepers of yours before you bleed to death. Yeah, don't roll your bloodshot eyes at me. I can tell you've been out on the street. 
It's plain that you are lying when you tell me you've been crying. So don't roll your foot shot eyes at me. I tried to match the timer. I could reverse up there. I tried to match. I was trying to go quick enough so that I could start shaking and oh, stuff. Okay. And then I realized, oh, I got to get this in the oven. And then I didn't want to do what I'm doing right now. <laughs> hey, uh, Melody, Penny says you need more booze. Oh, I thought you were going to say something else. I agree with Penny. Oh, booze. Booze. Oh, booze. Oh, booze. More booze. I well, know. I know. Give me a second here. All right. Penny, I get it. So maybe, Penny, you can help. Um, do I gotta whip a titty out? Is that what Penny said? If you, I mean, we're Penny, all... do I gotta whip a titty out? Is that what you're getting at? Because I'll do it. Nice. Yay. She said nice. Nice. Okay, there you go. We are mixing even parts. I don't know if it's even. I'm kind of just chucking it in there. But we are mixing vodka, coffee liqueur, yeah, Kahlua, <laughs> yeah. and amaretto, which is on our Italiano Mexicano theme. Yeah. I'm going to add all that, and we're going to add a little cream. Yeah, we do. Nice bum, 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 so, bum, 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 bum. so Angie asked, where are you, Penny? And Penny replied, I thought nice, but is she saying niece? Is she in France right now? No. Oh, okay. I thought she was just around the corner. Well, she's not here. All I know is she's not here. And that's upsetting. It is. It's a mystery. Things are smelling really I hope that this is. <laughs> this is yeah, the this place to be. Good. All right, is that bubbling? It is. It's still. All right. So let's have a little Actually, little before we shake this up, I want to get the gelatin in. So what we want to do is we want to take this off the heat, turn the heat off. We want to squeeze our Orlando bloomed gelatin. <laughs> gelatin is so weird. Anyway, here we go. All right, you just chuck it in, stir it up, and you want to make sure that it dissolves all the way because no one wants to bite into a slip of gelatin. All right, so, doesn't that look amazing already? Mm -hmm. I just want to take a show, bath in there. But, you know, if you but I don't think people would understand how good it smells. Is there any way to show here. the camera oh, that? Smells really good it stinks today. amazing in so here. Good. It stinks amazing in here. Can, you, really can you see it? It's thickened up a bit. My well, lips so shaky. Why am I shaky? All right. So gelatin is mixed in. Now we want to melt our chocolate in. Just chuck that right in there. Wow. Mix it up. Mix it up. Mm. Mm, right. Sorry. No, I'm. I always That's have to hold back it. those noises. I don't use gelatin that much, but it dissolves really instantly. It is dissolves instantly. The leaf gelatin does. The powdered gelatin takes a little bit more. Uh, not more, it's just a bit more. Anyway, all right, so that is all melted. And then the delicious ingredient, three tablespoons of amaretto. Mm -hmm. I promise this is the most you want to put in there because I did try and put more and it was just a bit too much. So, I so you're saying out. this whole time I could have been getting drunk on desserts? Is that oozy? You could, yeah. Wow. Boozy, boozy, boozy desserts. I've been All wasting right. my life. Oh. I'm only getting drunk on desserts from now on. This We're is amazing. Fresh. There you go. That's you right. should probably consult your new, doctor new before year, you New Year, new my doctor. Drunk on I sweets. play guitar for a living. Drunk I don't have a doctor. Sweets. No, okay. no health that. insurance for me. Here's <laughs> that. How long has that been in the oven? Um, I didn't set a timer. Live mm. time. I think like probably six minutes or so. Six minutes. It's somebody, six somebody minutes. back home, a good friend, scroll minutes back on your show. video and six minutes. All right, so set it for minute. four minutes. Okay. So we want the um the pie crust in the oven for about ten minutes, and then we're gonna take it out, put almonds, put it back in for five minutes to toast the almonds, and then let it sit. In the meantime, we're gonna shake this up, and we're gonna get a little toast cake. Yeah. There we go. Ooh. Ooh. I'm helping. Oh, good. Oh, good. I'm helping. Good. Go there. Everybody shake it up. Shake it up. Yeah. 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 us 
she's either working or sleeping. One of the two. She doesn't get much time to do much else. Oh, that looks so good. So it's got an almondy, coffee, creamy kick. Uh oh. I don't think I'm going to have. Yeah, I was jealous I didn't come down with you this year. I think that you guys, I'll take the loop. No offense, but I think this might be the dessert. It's a win all desserts here. It has all my favorite stuff in it. So. Oh, it's okay. Sometimes a plan just comes packed. together. I mean, we're talking about chocolate, booze, What did we caramel. make when Eden was here? Do you want to try? I don't remember. Pour it us some. How much? Like just a dollar? Just Wait, like the, a dollar. The whipped cream is for the drink. <laughs> oh. <laughs> well, that's a, oh, yeah, there you go. Creativity. <laughs> oh, I don't know. I got carried away with the cream there. Oh, look at that. Yeah, peak. Nope. Oh, I got it. Oh, it. I'm chasing the Oh, you dollar. got it. <laughs> this is homemade whipped cream. It's just cream, vanilla, and some powdered sugar. Nothing wrong with a heavy hand on the cream. Well, Angie said it looks good. <laughs> Beautiful. <laughs> Thank you. 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 Thank you.
because all the cute boys are here. Mm -hmm. So I have no idea what I'm doing right now. Okay, that's in the oven. Right. Mm -hmm. That's cooling. Right. We're drinking. Yeah. Yes. Right. Check. I need that stuff. All oh, right. Mm -hmm. We're going to make more <laughs> drinks. Right. Mm -hmm. So just equal parts. Equal of parts. All of it. Equal parts. Equal with great. It's good. What's good. What's good. What's good. What's good. Oh, what should we call it? Let's ask the audience. Um, it has vodka, Kahlua, mm -hmm. amaretto, and cream with some whipped cream. The what name guys... Melody. <laughs> <laughs> I kind of like that. Yeah, the Melody. <laughs> Wait a minute. All right, that's cool. All right, equal parts. I can do this. I'm going to pour the chocolate butterscotch deliciousness into another bowl to help it cool down. Delicious. Mm. I I hear Barry White in my head when you pour that chocolate. Oh, yeah? It just gets real horny. Yeah, let's hear it. I'm horny for chocolate. Yeah. Yeah. Horny for chocolate. So horny for chocolate. That could be a song. Horny for chocolate. That song is waiting to be written. I guess I now have a project when I get home. There you go. Yeah. I was, um, posting about Eddie's um, uh, being here. And I was going through social media and trying to find a song to put to the photo. And I was scrolling and I'm like, oh my goodness, he has tons and tons of music yes. up. You need to go and check out his music. It's rockabilly, it's fun, it's... You've got some nice uh, love is... ballads in there. Sure. And... Yeah, you got a sort of tender love ballad for the ladies once in a while. Mm -hmm. I, this is special for me because uh, normally I'm not allowed within 500 yards of Buttercup, but as you know, I have that song just, you know, all yeah. about her. And you do? I do. I, I have know. a Buttercup song. Yes. And then normally I, I'm usually, you know, an admirer from afar, usually the bushes or the tree line, but it's so nice to be here in the kitchen with you. What bush are we talking about? Watch. Tree line, he's <laughs> right. Okay. I'm sorry, Drake. The hedges are well The dog turned well into true. another dog. Okay. We have a suggestion for naming the drink. Oh, yeah, yeah. Richard says we should name it in honor of our guests, the Eddie Jet. Ooh. No, the Eddie Jet. Oh, wait. Eddie that made Jet. me think of a song. Eddie Jet. Uh -huh. What is that? Jet. Eddie, uh, Eddie, Eddie and the Jets? 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 Eddie the Jets? Eddie and 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 the Jets? And decorate this oh. this <laughs> tarp. Oh, here, oh, here. Oh, come here. Tarp rails. I'm going to get confidence. Oh, now I, know, I just, understand what was happening. Yeah, I, I saw that. We needed I to. Thought it would be hard to yeah. <laughs> we 